You guys, well, we are bringing the KCAL 9 Weather Watchers ah. back to our newscast. So hopefully some of you will sign up as well. So we're going to be talking about that. We're going to give you details on that throughout the next few days here. But I do want to check in with our Weather Watchers tonight. So let's get right to it and see who reported. And we're going to take you to the valley right here. And you will see Charles Pickett reporting from Granada Hills, 78 degrees just a few moments ago. So really a pretty warm night out there, but we are expecting cooler temperatures on the way. Let's get to our weather bug weather network and you will see our network of weather stations reporting just that. Six 67 degrees in Camarillo as we head to Diamond Bar 69, Westminster 67, and San Bernardino currently at 76 degrees. You'll see that right there. So temperatures quite mild, but a few spots a little warmer, as we just mentioned in the valley. We're talking temperatures in the 70s. So overall, a very warm day. In fact, temperatures today, a good five to seven degrees warmer compared to where we were just the other day. So we're going to have more on that coming up in just a little bit. I do want to take you through temperatures all across the Southland right now, and you will see numbers in the 60s and the 70s, 75 in Ontario, 66 LAX, 69 in Santa Ana. And as we get a look at sustained winds right now, you will notice wind speeds coming in from the west at the moment. So that onshore flow keeping temperatures just a little cooler for us. Earlier today, we made it to 80 in downtown with average being 84. So we were below average for this time of year. And eventually temperatures actually getting a little warmer before they cool off yet again. 64 overnight, mostly clear with cloud cover. Your satellite radar showing you mostly clear conditions. But what you don't see is a little bit of that fog rolling in. Generally, we see that on our visible satellite and we can only see the visible satellite in the daylight hour. So at night, that is not the case. But I will tell you a little bit of cloud cover out there. And as we zoom out and get a look at the big picture, take a look at what's sitting to our south. There's Hurricane Newton spinning up the coast of Baja, taking a track toward Arizona and the desert southwest. So most of that tropical moisture going that direction, but we could stand to see a little bit of it here at home. Hopefully a little bit of rain. There is a slight chance out there and we will continue to track that slight chance. But again, it is out there. Temperatures tomorrow in the 70s, 80s and the 90s, keeping things that way for the next few days. But overall, we will see a bit of a cooling trend as we head toward the end of the week. Take a look right here. The beaches in the 70s, the basin in the 80s, turning down to the 70s by Friday, low 80s by the weekend. And the valleys, take a look at this in the 90s and back down to the 80s by the end of the week, slightly warmer by the weekend, cooler again by next week. Coming up, we're going to get a look at your seven-day forecast for the IE, the high desert, and the mountains. And again, it's going to be a little cooler, but we're going to have all the details in the 9 o'clock hour. Back to you guys.